Hey guys, how are you going to find the distance between two coordinates on the xy plane? The answer is the distance formula, which is just like the slope formula y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1, except the difference between the y's and x's are distances to be used in the Pythagorean theorem, where the distance squared is the change in y squared plus the change in x squared. Watch how this works. What is the distance between 1 comma 7 and negative 12 comma 2? Well, I'm going to call this x1 and, oh, huh, y1. I'm going to call this x2 and y2. All right, the distance then is equal to the square root of y2 minus y1 squared plus x2 minus x1 squared. Let's take a look here. We've got negative 5 squared and we've got negative 13 squared. That makes 25 and 13 squared is 169. When you add those two together you get 194. And so the final distance is whatever the square root of 194 is. 194 square root 13.9. So these two points on the xy plane are separated by 13.9 or about 14 units. This comes in handy when you're trying to prove that certain coordinates make up squares or rectangles or an equilateral triangle when you need to show that side lengths have particular lengths or distances between the points. Long story short, to find the distance between two points, y2 minus y1 squared plus x2 minus x1 squared, and you take the square root of that. Should remind you of the Pythagorean theorem, because it is the Pythagorean theorem. Yeah, best of luck.